We'd like to get your personal take on a tweet that went viral oh, recently. She's very rude. No, no, but I don't know what happened. <laughs> so he told her that it smells nice. No, you're not saying, you know, tell her how it started. She came, he came for an interview and he was leaving. At the and interview. he told the interviewer that she smells nice. Yes. He is rude. No, no, she just said that's rude. Yeah, yeah. Her response to him. That she smells nice? Yeah. Why is that rude? Hello, my name is Felicia Badamosi and I am mm, Wando. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, I'm starting. Sorry. What's wrong with you now? <laughs> it's your fault. Hello, my name is Felicia Badamosi and I am Director in Charge of Business Processes and Technology at Prime Atlantic. I am also an Executive Council Member and the Chair of the Annual Lecture Committee of WIMBIS, Women in Management, Business and Public Service. Hello everyone, my name is Wando Yembe Hassan. I'm an Asset Manager and I work for Wando Energy Resources. I handle non-operated ventures on the marginal fields. I'm also the head of fundraising for the WIMBIS annual lecture series and we're here to talk to you through what WIMBIS does, what we stand for and why you should look forward and attend the WIMBIS lecture, annual lecture next week. Alright, let's do this. So with this year's theme for the International Women's Day being um, a balance for better, with certain countries striving for gender equality in the workplace, what stage do you think Nigeria and Africa is at achieving a balance for better? Okay, so in my opinion, um, Africa as a whole and Nigeria are quite far from where we need to be, you know, as far as having more gender balance, you know, in government positions, in um, organizations, in the boardrooms, you know, where the key decisions are being made. We certainly need to have more gender representation. And I personally like the fact that some con countries have mandated, you know, um, that there should be a certain ratio of men to women because the truth is that it's always good to have a balance, you know, of both genders when we're making key decisions. Can you talk to us about WIMBIS? What is WIMBIS and how is it benefiting Nigeria's women? Okay, WIMBIS is a non-profit organization that was started in 2001. Over the last 16 years, its aim is to create a platform where women can get inspired and empowered and they can advocate for women inclusion in most of the public sector or the business opportunities that exist. Um, today, Wimby's prides itself where it has committed over 500 associates registered across the, all sectors of Nigeria, across different structures, executive management and lower level, to be able to impact the view and the voice of women in all areas and to ensure that we're included where decisions are being made that affect all levels of women. Okay, and what type of lady would you say should attend such an event? So, Wimbiz is open to all levels of yeah, women. Everybody. Everybody. Mm -hmm. We have, we're hoping about 800 women. As at today, a week to the conference, we will have over 500 women registered. Anybody can attend. The plan is to, for you to be able to come for three hours of your day and get impacted to see that there is no level or there's no industry mm -hmm. that any woman cannot excel in. Yeah. She's going to talk us through where she started from, how she's gotten BAP Productions and Terra Culture from where it was to where it is today, and how every single woman, whatever you can chart, you decide your chart is, you start from the ground and you just, through mentorship and fellowship, you can get to where you're going. Can you tell us when and where this workshop will be taking place? So, the annual lecture series takes place on March 21st at 9 o'clock to 12 o'clock. It's going to take place at the Muson Center. And yeah, it's from 9 to 12, just like Wandu just said. Um, and it's going to be impactful. We also have the opportunity for a panel session. So not only do you get to listen to all that our keynote speaker has to say, you also get to ask questions. And the panel is going to be moderated by the amazing Didi Akinyelure. And well, I mean, we are excited about the fact that we're just going to have a power-packed and amazing session. Key focus should remain that this is not a full day event. Yeah. This is two, three hours of your day, yeah. hoping that you come in and you listen and you take little nuggets that apply to you and see how it can affect you to understand where we are as a person, where we are as a country, and what we're trying to get to in terms of gender equality. What is the registration process for this event? For the annual lecture, the registration process is you go online, wimbiz.org, yeah. on the homepage, 
there should be a box that speaks to registration. You register. Obviously, this has been on social media for over two months now. The early bird of 12,000 has closed. It's going to cost you 15,000 naira from now till the day before. On the day, it's going to cost you 20,000 naira to register. And we can't wait to see you there. Hi, my name is Felusha. Hi, my name is Wando. And we hope to see you next week, March 21st, Thursday, at the Wimbiz Annual Lecture 2019. See you soon. Thank you.